checking out all the good food at Balloon Fiesta. Yeah, Danielle, so lunchtime starts a little bit earlier here at Balloon Fiesta Park, so we are starting our food journey with Dora Platero of Platero Fry Bread. How's it going? It's good this morning, going good. So you guys are preparing the uh, fry bread and the homemade tortillas, right? So something to note is that you guys are 100% Navajo owned and women owned as well. Uh, yes, we are. We are women owned business. So talk about kind of your journey through uh, this whole effort. Um, I understand that you guys started from humble beginnings, right? Yes, we did. Being a, a parent, working full time, going to school part time and then my children wanted needing and wanting to be a part of a sports and other extracurricular activities you know all that takes money and, and not in the budget so I just started out making making bread on the weekends on Saturday and that kind of covered everything you know that the kids needed so that's how we started and fast forward 20 years later did you ever think it would be this busy <laughs> no, I didn't think it would be this busy. I mean, we got we got a little popularity there for a little while, you know, doing special events like Indian Market and the Zobra Fiestas and Freedom Fourth and now the Balloon Fiesta. And it's been going great. We have a pretty good following. People come out and see us and they enjoy our food. So it's, it's been great. Yeah, and we're right here on Vendor Row, and you take a look at some of the food vendors here. Lots of franchises, lots of chains, but this is the one place where you can get authentic Native American food, right? That's correct. We this is one. I believe there's, I believe there's another, but this is one that you can get. This, like I said, like we said earlier, you know, we're a 100% Native American woman-owned operation. So, about how many uh, Navajo tacos do you guys shell out on a given day? Oh my goodness! I I I lost count. Yeah. I, I just I couldn't give you a number because I I I'm just busy. We're just so busy that we're just making the bread back here. Yeah. So this this right here is the uh, is this the tortilla or the fry the bread? The homemade tortilla right okay. here. Okay. And and what are some of the differences between the homemade tortilla and the regular tortillas we're seeing? Well, the regular tortillas are pretty thin and they're packaged. They're pre-packaged and they're refrigerated or frozen. Here, you know, we make it all. All made fresh here. No packages here. No heat lamps here. <laughs> so what are you looking forward to most and uh, kind of what is the interaction between you and your customers? That they're getting something authentic. That's what I like. And a lot of our t customers do come over and thank us for that. They're getting something authentic. It's fresh. It's made here. They see it. And most of all, we're na native people. You know, we're, native, we're a native business and they like to see that. Yeah, this is the New Mexico experience, right? The best of both worlds. You get to enjoy the sights of the colorful balloons here, and you get to enjoy native um, American food here with you guys, right? That's right. Now it's time for a burger. Yeah, like I mentioned, Danielle, lunchtime starts way earlier here at Balloon Fiesta. So next stop on our food journey is Rex's Hamburgers, possibly the most popular spot to get a hamburger this early in the morning. And joining me now is Rex's himself. How's it going? Very good. How's everybody today at the uh, Balloon Fiesta? Uh, pretty well. So I can smell the cinnamon rolls. I can smell a hamburger this early. What? Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, we do it all. We'll have the full menu. We'll go from the time we open up in the, in the morning uh, because, you know, some people are burritos, some people are burgers, some people are pizza. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's everything. Yeah. Some, you know, it's, it's always uh, variations. Yeah. And you guys have been a fixture here in New Mexico for quite some time, right? Yeah, we've been uh, at the New Mexico State Fair for 52 years. We opened up here in 1969 with my uh, family. And what have you, so 26 years out here at Fiesta, so, you know, we got some time spent. <laughs> Obviously, you guys specialize in hamburgers, uh, green chili cheeseburgers, right? Um, but in the mornings, you guys also have uh, breakfast burritos, too. Oh, yeah, you, get, you can't do Fiesta without a breakfast burrito. I mean, it's just what it is. It's, our, it's a staple. It's, a, it's, a, it's everything to uh, the morning here. Hot chocolate, coffee, breakfast burrito, you're ready to go. And what's your favorite part about coming here um, year after year at Balloon Fiesta? Actually, it's always the people. It's just enjoyable. It's what we do best. It's what we, uh, it's what we strive for. And, uh, you know, it's uh, everything there is. Yeah.
right. And you got some cinnamon rolls on oh, display yeah. and, a, and a hamburger too, right? Oh, I can yeah. see it coming out. Yep. Just uh, wave my magical pocket fork, and there you go. So what do we have here? Oh, this is a green chili cheeseburger, uh, kind of the staple here that we always do, and uh, uh, balloon fair, everything. You know, it's what I do. All right, so as I toss it back to you, Danielle, I'm going to do a little taste test for you guys this morning just for uh, quality control. <laughs> So you recognize this guy. We have made our way to the final stop of our food journey here at Balloon Fiesta. Of course, we had to end with Blake's Burger. The breakfast burritos here have been a staple at Balloon Fiesta. And joining me now is David, who oversees the operations here at Balloon Fiesta. So, David, rough estimate, how many burritos do you guys shell out on a given day here? Uh, you know, it's, it's ex we're extremely busy. You know, our, our stores, we sell so many burritos every morning. And you can imagine with the lines we have out here, it, it's... A, a huge number. Yeah, and today is supposed to be one of the slower days, but you can already see the lines forming right behind us here. Um, so what's the best part about being here and being such a fixture at Balloon Fiesta? We just love seeing our guests that we see in the stores every day. Uh, everybody's so glad to see us and just the reliable breakfast that they have every day. So that and at night when we have our lot of burgers, you know, it's just it's great to see our people. And then people from out of town get to experience the true New Mexico experience. And then we see Blake just welcoming guests right here as well. And so, like I mentioned, Danielle, I've been using my pocket fork and uh, it's been working pretty well. So, how it works is I wave my pocket fork and all of a sudden food just shows up. And there you go. <laughs> all right, so this is a bacon and green chili uh, breakfast burrito here. Look how good that looks. All right, so David, I'm going to do something real quick. I have to do a taste test for quality control. Um, grab the other burrito. And we're going to set this down and we'll do a burrito cheers for you guys. Cheers. There you go. So good. Man. Yeah. Great every day. 